Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Peglin. We are jumping in once again on the cruel, cruel crucible. And we get, do you know what unicorn horn off the bat? I don't mind that at all. Uh, I did watch a video very recently of uh, the spiffing Brit playing this game and absolutely demolishing it. If you want to see some really buggy stuff with this game, uh, I won't say, I won't call it buggy, but like, ridiculously easily abused stuff. I'd, I'd take a look at him. I'm gonna gamble here on this and see if I can, uh, yes. Oh, come on. I was like, it'll drop right on the crit. Nope, missed the crit entirely. Um, but yeah, he basically created this build with like, I think it's like four specific items that makes it so that you literally cannot die. Like, it's impossible for you to die and everything dies just by you passing your turns. It's, it's, it was absolutely ludicrous. Like, honestly, one of the craziest builds I've ever seen in Pegland. <laughs> and it, like, didn't take that many items to get it going either. Um, yeah, not great. Honestly, we're going to take some hot damage here because I'm having a really hard time getting down to that bomb. Um, but we'll see. There you go. That helps a good amount, but not, not a lot. I've still taken quite a lot of damage here. For that. Oh, for God's sake, it's seven damage. Come on now. Nine damage. Okay, this is really going very terribly. This is so much damage to have taken on the first turn here. Yeah, it went for the crit. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Took a bit of a beating there, but it's alright. Um, Let's go for one of these, Swole Torb here. And... Shop off the bat is honestly not really worth. I could have taken I could have uh, gone for a removal there, but it's fine. Um upgrade knob or remove an orb. Okay, let's re let's remove a stern off the bat here. And then go question mark again. Someone did tell me what, what you get for this. I think I think reaching into the nook gives you, yeah, it can give you up to a brand ball level three, and it did, and apparently that's gonna be super helpful early game, so I'm kinda glad I went for that. It can be level one to three. Um, I'm going to go with the extra HP here. I'm going to keep on with the question marks, to be honest, because I'm kind of liking those right now. Um, use the forge. Use the satchel to scoop the forge. A special relic or upgrade around. Let's go for the special relic. Whenever an orb is added to your deck, upgrade it and lose 4 HP. You know what? That's kind of interesting. I like that. Um, and then how easy is it going to be for us to get down here? Not too bad, not too bad. Cool, question mark again, good stuff. Um, and yeah, let's take a moment to rest. The bad thing apparently was nothing. That's fine by me. Okay, good, good, good. Oh, that wasn't really where I wanted to fall there, but not bad damage regardless. Grand Ball's not gonna matter all that much here. Um, go for the bomb. Oh, I missed the bomb. Okay, that refresh is unfortunately in a really rough spot. be nice to, to remove some self damage here if possible because we are taking quite a bit at the minute oh, come on that that refresh is gonna be a nightmare for us to get to be honest an absolute nightmare like we're gonna lose a lot of health trying to get to this refresh i think yeah we're gonna lose a lot of health trying to get to this refresh it just kind of is what it is i'm gonna go for this for now i realize that this is like completely whiffing in every way possible. 35 damage there, that's fine. There you go, we finally got to it. Absolute pain in the ass, but we got there in the end. Yeah, our health is really not looking very good right now. I'm not a fan of that. Let's get to that bomb, shall we? Missed that refresh again there, lovely. I've cut my finger and it's really bloody hurting. I don't know what to cut it on. Not good though, I don't like it. You dead as well. Don't think I can get to a crit easily here. Again, the refresh just in an astronomically terrible position. One of my biggest gripes with this game is when, when you've only got one refresh and it's just like, <laughs> fuck you. Ninety-six. Come on, that's so close. Right, at least you're dead. That was a lot of HP to lose. I think we're going to go for a heal here. 
And honestly, we could go for an upgrade as well. Let's upgrade you. And then... Bombs apply a blind when damaging enemies. Only blind one, though. Let's go with this, because although pretty crap right now, it could scale to be pretty interesting. Eventually. Plus one discards or extra choices. Hmm. Plus one discards seems good to me. Extra choices is always good, but the plus one discard could make for a really interesting uh, situation. Duplicate all of our orbs. Um, It's going to duplicate a rock if I duplicate random. I'm going to go with duplicate all. Just for the pure fact that I just got the discard plus one, which might mean I can deal with getting more stones. It's a very thick deck now, which I don't like. Also, these guys again on this HP is uh, very bad. <laughs> oh, oh bollocks. I just realized something. Um, oh no, I'm dead. I took a bunch of orbs and this upgraded them all. And I lost 4 HP for everyone added, so now I have no HP. So I'm gonna die. Thanks, Bramble, for jumping over the back there. Exactly what I wanted. Yeah, so now... Oh, dude, the Bramble's not doing what I wanted to at all. It's pissing me off. Yeah, I'm d Unfortunately, I'm dead here, so just kill me. So there's not much point playing the rest of this out. Thank you. Thanks for that. That was fun. God damn it, one second. Yeah, I really didn't think about the consequences of my actions in that last one there. Let's go with that. Why not? Okay. And keep her going. That was not great. <laughs> okay. Go for the bomb there. That's actually really good damage off the bat. Bombs detonating nearby stuff is not super, super good on its own, but it can pair pretty nicely later on. There you go. Okay, damage on you. I'm just going to go straight for the bombs, I'll be honest. Nice refresh there as well. You got most of the money on this stage too. Not a ton, but it's a good amount. And there you go. You're dead as well, lovely. 36 gold. Just check our map real quick. We don't have a shop coming up. I'm going to go for another one of you. I like those orbs. Even if it thickens up our deck a little bit. We'll go for the question marks again, of course. I mean, we kind of have to this time around. Uh, crit ball. Okay, let's take another small orb if we can manage it. I'm not very good at this. So I'm going to try doing that tactic. Oh, bloody hell. Crit ball. Every attack is a crit. Converts every eight pegs. Hit into crits. I don't know how useful that is. I'll take it. Okay, nice. Got to the treasure. Let's go with the eye. Let's go straight for the treasure again. And strange brew. Let's go with the strange brew, yeah. Pressure mark again here. And then straight to the elite, I think. Unfortunately, it's a battle right off the bat here. Really, really good to have this orb on this stage here, because it's just, we're hitting the same ones so often. Unfortunately, yet again, our refresh is in a horrible, horrible, horrible spot, so let's just keep going until we can get to the refresh. Nice. Really good damage come out of this right now. I left you on one HP. Lovely. Okay, it literally can't hit other crits. That's kind of interesting to know. Okay, a lot, lot easier for us to hit crits in this current setup here. I like that. Do not like the way I set this up, though. This is horrible. Come on, why don't you hit the refresh, you fool? Just waste the damage right there. Um, Upgrade this bad boy. I think that could work quite well. And then Elite. Elite shouldn't be too bad here. Again, really good one to get the Swole Torb on. 
didn't hit the refresh, unfortunately. And the refresh is again not in a great spot, but we should be able to, I guess I should be able to hit it anyways. Again, refresh here is not terrible. Good damage. Not what I was hoping for there. Hundred and something damage. Probably gonna take another hit from this guy. Unfortunately, this refresh is b -b -b bad. This refresh is real fucking bad. Oh my god. No, come on. Okay, there's another hit. We might die to this guy. Okay, not too bad, but very, very close. Um, I'm going to upgrade an orb. Let's upgrade that to max. Let's heal. Let's go with that. It's pretty good. Go for the item here. Go with that. Go this way. Whenever a crit is triggered, deal all your orbs damage to uh, to all enemies. Eh, I think we're better off going for that, I think. And then let's just go this way. Should we try and head down to one of those shops over there or not? I'm not quite sure. Oh well, yeah, this stage is always a pain in the ass. Always drops straight through the cracks. So hard to actually hit the yeah, bombs. That was better. There you go. That was good. Hmm. I don't know what to take here. I could go with some upgrades. I don't want to flash out my deck too much, but a bold orb would be really nice. I'm going to take a bold orb. A question mark here. I'm just going to take all the question marks now. Okay, terrible, terrible orb to take here. I'm literally not going to do any damage. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Good. Try and take out as many as I can to get to the bomb here. Leave you with one HP as well, god damn it. Okay. Not too bad. Let's take the Doctorb as well here. And we got question marks. Trying to upgrade the Doctorb if I can get it on question marks. Cheese. Cheese is one of the items that you use to glitch out the game. Same with the round guard. We'll go for cheese. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't care which one we get here, really. All of these are okay. Cheese would be fine. Thank you. Check behind the waterfall. Thank you. Okay. Don't know if I'm going to die to this boss or not. 33 HP is leaving me. Thinking I definitely am going to, but we'll find out as it goes, I guess. Getting to these bombs is an absolute nightmare. Okay, good amount of crits created there. Oh, <laughs> bombs are screwing me. I'm so dead here, unfortunately. He's eating me. I kind of have to use the Doctorb here, otherwise I'm going to die, I think. But it's not going to hit enough to do anything good. Give me 20 health. Enough, I guess. Probably still dead here, unfortunately. 
Well, it's been an absolutely fantastic episode thus far. I'm really fucking enjoying myself. Oh my god, what's the point? Crucible, you're fucking cruel. God damn it, I hate this crucible. If you're at full health post battle, healing instead allows you to increase your max HP by four. Doesn't sound great. Let's just take the stone damage. Not happy. Not happy at all. Just get absolutely shafted over and over again in this game. The Crucible, with the, the one that reduces the amount of refreshes you have, in my opinion, is just so brutal. But I just, this game is so, so deceptively difficult. It's so hard, honestly. I can hit this bomb now. I'm just going to go for the bomb. Okay, good. 48 damage to enemy with 2 health is perfect. No dead as well. Crit's impossible to get here. Or reasonably impossible. Why you got to jump over the refresh like that, game? Why you got to do me dirty like that? Oh, come on, you were rolling right towards the crick. You couldn't have just carried on going, could you? Damn. I, I'm torn. Because I, I, I do very much enjoy this game, but I might have to stop playing it soon for my own sanity. Because I'm just bad at it. I'm just really, really bad at it. <laughs> and it just, it's a game that just makes me so angry. Like, I don't get mad at games that often, but this game really rubs me the wrong way sometimes. With a Bramble level one, not worth my time at all. What was the point in this? Ugh. Okay, that is very good damage off the bat here. Didn't hit the refresh somehow there. Love that. Nice. Got the bomb there. At least my stones are doing a little bit more now. That's nice. Still not enough, but a little bit more. Yeah, this stage is pro probably one of the worst in the entire game for getting bad refresh locations. They're just so impossibly difficult to hit on purpose if they, if they like, land in a bad location. Like, this one here is just absolutely ass. I just can't get to it. I've got to waste so many turns just yeeting orbs over there in the hopes that I hit the refresh and not every single orb around it. But there you go. Just the way the cookie crumbles sometimes, I guess. But yeah, I need to figure out, like, if I'm going to swap this game out for something, what it would be. I've got a few things in mind, but I'll have to see. Um, just go for the build that is tried and true and literally always works. Just go for bombs. Jackfire attacks pierce an additional enemy. Or refreshes. Yeah, we'll go with that. Really, you managed to bounce me into the shop there. Don't know how you did that, but thanks. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Anger and confusion. See, bomb build, there's nothing that there's nothing better than bomb build. Honestly. Just just go, go for go for anything else and you'll fail. Go for bomb build. It's easy. I always try to deviate. I always think, oh no, I'll try to not do bomb build this time. No. Nope. If you go for anything else, you're a fool. It's bomb build and nothing else. It's the best thing. It works every time. 
so much better than any other build out there. Yeah, there's, there's, there's a lot of balancing issues in this game, in my opinion. It's so fun, but goddamn, the balance is so off. Just heal. My health is terrible. How on earth are you going to fall into that fire? I don't, ugh. Just not going where I wanted to at all, is it, today? The question mark. Lose some HP that I just healed up. Lovely. Go to an elite that'll probably kill me. All the bombs are primed and ready to go, but I'm not actually blowing any of them up. And I'm going to get hit here for a ton of damage. Oh, come on, hit some of these bombs, please. There you go. He's dead. Have to heal again. Go for that bad boy. For a treasure chest. Off of the stone, thank you. Right, here we are. This time, on less health, but we do have our bomb build to back us up, so... It might not be so bad. Unfortunately, we hit about four pegs there, so... That was pretty worthless. Oh, God, this game. This game! Man! Gets me going. Not in a good way. Why is the refresh all the way down here? What kind of use to me is that? Well, this has been a fantastic episode. I hope you guys have really enjoyed. That has been the epitome of my Peglin experience. I might just go back to not playing Crucible, because I just don't think it's that fun. <laughs> like, I'm just getting absolutely smushed, and I feel like my build diversity is getting severely hampered, because you have to have piercing or bombs for the second floor, otherwise you die. And I seem to just die on the first floor anyways. So... I feel like I'm going to have to go back to not playing Crucible because it just isn't working out and it's just, I don't know, it just makes the game less fun in my opinion. So the game's too hard. And yeah, I'm not saying this is the last episode of Peglin, but I am severely go going to be checking for other options because while I'm enjoying it, my blood pressure is severely increasing playing this game. Um, <laughs> anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.